six months in two days. He's becoming a big boy. He knows quite a few commands. He's a smart little guy, but and he doesn't want to pay attention to the camera. This is Monty. He's a good boy. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be answering some frequently asked questions about French Bulldogs. And I just Googled like the most commonly asked questions and I wrote some down on my phone. And so I'm gonna be referencing that. But before we get into it, please like and subscribe. This is a new channel and we're getting it off the ground. I'm really excited to be creating more content for you guys. Let me know what you'd like to see out of this channel and I'll be sure to make that video or those videos that you uh, request. But without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the video. So the first commonly asked question is, are Frenchies hard to train? And the answer to that is sometimes. Now I know that's not like a full straight on answer like you probably are wishing for, but Frenchies can be stubborn. However, they can also be very intelligent. Certain things they're gonna be better at than others, where Monty learned sit within a day and he learned treat within hours, but it took him almost three months to fully walk on a leash. So it's just going to depend on what they're in the mood to do because they are so stubborn. So for example, uh, learning potty training and housebreaking near Frenchie might be a little bit difficult depending on how stubborn they are with it or how you try to potty train them. But all around, Frenchies are intelligent dogs, but depending on their level of stubbornness, they can be hard to train. Next question is, are Frenchies family friendly and the are family friendly and the answer to this is absolutely yes. Frenchies uh, go well with other dogs, with kids, with people. Frenchies are just attention seeking dogs that love attention from anything that they can get and they are so lovable and so friendly. My experience with Monty is that he has always been friendly towards other people, including visitors, including people out on the streets. He's always one to run up to other people and other dogs, want to be picked up, want to get attention from them. And that's all I've seen from other Frenchies as well. When we go to Frenchie meetups, we're around 40 Frenchies and they're all so friendly. We've never had a problem with a dog fight or with aggression in Frenchies. They are very friendly. There was one time where Monty ran up to a statue trying to get attention. So he is so friendly and most Frenchies are from what I've seen. The next question is, can Frenchies swim? And the answer to this is absolutely not. I've never seen a Frenchie that has been an avid swimmer. They are built like tanks, um, which means that they are top heavy so that they can fall in easily, but then they can't really paddle, which is really scary. So make sure when your Frenchie is around water, they have a life jacket. I can recommend one down below that we have for Monty. But if your Frenchie is around a body of water, be very careful and make sure that they are supervised at all times. The next question is, can I travel with my French Bulldog? Now we have, I don't have as much experience traveling with my Frenchie on airplanes quite yet. He's going on his first trip um, in May on the airplane. So I'll keep you updated with that. And there will be tons of vlogs with that um, and videos around that question. But certain airlines, do restrict the breed due to their smushed faces and the liabilities with that. Some uh, also, airlines also restrict dogs over 20 pounds. So if your Frenchie is over 20 pounds, you might have a little bit of a harder time with that. But all around, Frenchies can travel well. They can be good travel companions. It's just depending on what airline you're traveling with, you know, what carrier, if they if they do well in a carrier. A lot of Frenchies do require like a calming treat. You can get this from your vet. I know Chewy uh, has some. So just depending on that, if your Frenchie has anxiety while traveling or anything like that. But the answer overall is yes, Frenchies do travel well for the most part. The next commonly asked question is what is the average weight of an adult French Bulldog? And the answer to this is anywhere from for males 28, 26 to 28, and for females 22 to 26. Now this is a range, this is just the average. Do not feel like if your Frenchie is above or below that that is anything wrong with your Frenchie. I know for Monty, both of his parents, both his mom and his dad were both 20 pounds. So we're not expecting him to get over that. He will be a bit on the smaller side. So he will not fit within the average range of a typical adult male Frenchie. That's totally okay. That doesn't mean that they're not healthy. That's just the overall average. 
And the last question that I am going to be answering in this video is do Frenchies shed? And the answer is yes. Most all dogs will shed at some point. However, they are short haired. So a simple bath or brush could really limit that shedding. But if your pup is shedding a lot, that could be a type of allergy, consider switching up their food or adding maybe a fish oil to their food to make their coat more shiny. Also, if your Frenchie has bald spots or parts of their hair that they're like itching at specifically, you might wanna check for fle uh, fleas, ticks, or parasites. Just, you know, most people know this, but just giving them information to you if you do notice that your Frenchie has bald spots or itches a certain uh, spot specifically, make sure to check for that. And then also pregnant females can tend to shed more. Now that's a very, you know, small group of Frenchies. It's like the pregnant females, but that is just something to look out for if your Frenchie is pregnant. So that is it for today's video. This is Mr. Monty. If you guys haven't had the opportunity to meet him already, he will be six months in two days. So he's becoming a big boy. He's doing really well with training. He is completely potty trained. He is um, completely leash trained. He knows quite a few commands. So he's a smart little guy, but, and he doesn't want to pay attention to the camera. He normally doesn't, but this is Monty. He's a good boy. Anyway guys, thanks again for checking out this video. Please like and subscribe and comment what kind of content you'd like to see because I really wanna get this channel off the ground and kick off the channel, you know, by putting out the videos you guys would like. So please let me know. Again, like and subscribe and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye guys.